Hello, family, and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Shanisha Nicole, and I am back again with another DIY video. To all of my new supporters, welcome. I hope you like it here. And my returning supporters, hey, boo. Okay, that picture y'all just seen was our inspiration. And to get that done, we got to go to the store, okay? And y'all know I love to shop. So here I am at Rainbow. They had a lot of cute, um, solid color dresses. So if you want to do this, this is what you're going to look for. Um, just something just plain, simple, nothing major. And they was, girl, only... $9.99, okay? Not not the imitation. Girl, cut it out. Okay, but it did smell good. All right. So now that we got our goods, we on our way home. And these are the supplies that you are going to need to get this done. You got you're gonna need your dress. You're gonna need a hard surface um to do this on. I'm doing it on my living room table. I hope you guys got your dresses in a few sizes bigger. I got a 3X. You're gonna need your scissors, some clamps straight pins or like some kind of safety pins will be better because you're gonna have to pull this and stretch it to make it fit to your body so it's gonna be like kind of like a form-fitting dress and as you pull you're gonna clip or pin all the way down both sides of the dress okay so once you got everything pinned and pulled this is what it's going to look like and this is why you got to get it in a few sizes bigger because you're going to pull it so that your fringes can um be a little long so if you got it right on the size that you need it's not the fringes are not going to give okay so after you've pinned and clipped you are going to um get a white chalk or a crown i use crown because that's all i had you're going to trace down wherever you pinned and clipped that all the way down both sides of the dress okay and it's gonna look like this you're gonna see like the shape of your body that you um pulled and pinned all right so now that we outlined our dress like a dead body okay what you're gonna do is you're gonna get your scissors and you're gonna cut your fringes and you're gonna cut them starting from the outside of the dress working your way in and you're gonna stop at the white line that you traced okay and you're gonna make this the um slits in the dress kind of thin but not too thin because we're going to pull them and you don't want them to like rip off or anything once you're done it's going to look like this on both sides cute give it pocahontas but it's cute real real cute don't forget to cut that tag out the inside of the dress before you get started because girl i forgot about it and it gave me a hard time all right so with the fringes what you are going to do is you're going to cut them at the seam so it's going to make two and then you're going to pull pull really really hard and stretch it on out girl because it's going to give it like length to the fringes so you just keep stretching but like i said not too hard because you don't want to pull them off so you're going to just stretch it and you're going to do them down both sides of the dress it's coming out real cute like i said i did this one whole time i don't even know what i was saying right here like i did i, I recorded this for tiktok too so i don't know if i was talking to him or not but um yeah i did one whole side and after i got to the bottom i realized like how i'm gonna make this work and up under the armpits too like i was a little bit confused but y'all are gonna see how it all came together but yeah keep watching because your girl was a little stuck but i made it work
I just had to give y'all a top view of this dress, honey. And look how it's giving body, okay? Look at the form, like, shaped out of the dress already, girl. I can tell she better do some damage when I put her on. Right here, I'm just doing a close-up or, like, a different angle of me showing y'all how I do the fringes so that y'all can see what I'm doing. Like I said, you're going to cut at the seam of the dress then you are going to just pull pull really tight um it's gonna make two just keep pulling them i use the edge of the table to do mine i just pulled it and stretched it out past the edge of the table and then once i got it um you know stretched out to capacity then i tied it in a double knot and then i pulled pulled it some more and then you're going to tie the knot kind of kind of tight but not too tight because like i said you don't want the fringes to pop off and then it's going to be like holes like little peep holes inside of the dress you don't want to stretch those out either by pulling too um too much so that's all i did just cut stretch and double knot that's it Okay, so this is why I had to finesse, you know, some things at a bit. So this is how it was looking before I cut it. So I just cut off the, like, the trimming of the dress on the pit area. And then I, you know, stretched it or poured it just like you would do the fringes. And it'll give it, like, a nice, um, light look to it. It's not so raw. So it's not like a raw cut. So all I did was just cut it all the way around. And it's going to leave, like... I left a little bit of um, fabric on the edge of it so that I can tie and make a fringe with that as well under the armpit. Hmm. 
Y'all don't mind me right here. I don't know what the hell I was doing or what I was thinking, what I was trying to do, but it ended up not being it, okay? All right, guys, so we have made it to the end of this video, and I hope you guys like what you see. This is the outcome of the dress, and I am loving it, okay? Like, I decided to tie them. You can sew down the um, edges. Bitty, bitty, bum, bum. Okay, that's what it's giving. You can sew down the edge of the dress, too, so I kind of want to do another one a different color, and I'll probably do it that way, but I'm liking it. I love it, love it. Give it a little peep show on the sign, okay? Yeah get into it really really cute thank you guys for tuning in don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video and tell a friend and tell a friend and tell a friend about shanidra nicole and y'all come on over and join the crew where it's lit at okay more videos coming soon bye